Sister Fatima is asking about what a lot of the people say that if carrying a body of a deceased when carrying the corpse of a person, if it is heavy, this means that this is a bad sign. And if it is light, then this is a good sign. This has no foundation of uh, uh, backing it up. Some would think that if a person is like 400 pounds or someone who is like 180 kilograms in weight, this person is fat, he's big, he's huge. So to carry him, you have to have strong men to do so. Sometimes the men themselves say that his body was so light, we did not feel anything. So this gives the people an impression that maybe the angels helped carrying him, but we do not have any concrete evidence to support this. Therefore, it was not mentioned in the Quran or in the Sunnah that the weight of the corpse, the weight of the deceased when being carried to his grave has any significance. So if it's heavy, it means that he is an evil person with bad deeds, and if it's light, then it is good. No, I don't personally know anything that backs this up. So it doesn't matter whether the people complained from the weight or not. What counts is the style of life he led, whether he was among the worshipers, he used to observe prayers on time, he used to avoid haram. This is what counts his reputation among the Muslims, they compliment him after his death, saying that he was a good person. This is what counts. A is for Allah, nothing but Allah. Ba is the beginning of Bismillah. Ta is for Taqwa, be wearing of Allah. And Tha is for Thawab, a reward.